guys and welcome back to this Newcastle FIFA 20 career mode. Good episode last time out. Managed to get ourselves in the FA, no, the Carabao Cup semi-final by beating Manchester City. We do, of course, play Spurs in the next round of that a little later on in the season. Thanks for the hosts coming through. Ben Sheridan, thanks so much. We are taking on Liverpool in the first game of this episode today. And Liverpool occupy that fourth place that we desperately want, but are massive outsiders for at this stage. The gap is nine points, so you could say... This game is a six-pointer as this episode we will be heading into the second half of the season. Good run of form, and who knows, we could challenge for it. Let's go, let's get the win. We're at the fortress, the fortress that is not really a fortress. St. James's, well, on this game anyway, it's a bit of a fortress in real life. Great atmosphere there. This is the lineup that we've gone with, a very familiar looking team. Um, no real surprises, maybe Kovalenko starting. Ahead of Weston McKennie is the only surprise, but the rest of it. And Almiron, he doesn't always start either, but he's playing on the right. We've gone with pace. It's that false nine for Liverpool. Mane, Firmino and Salah. Going to be very difficult to keep quiet. But no Jordan Henderson, which is a shame because being a Sunderland boy, I'd love to just smashed him today. Yes, Kappa. Good interception. Good ball inside as well. Here's Paqueta, who has been the star man over the last 10 games or so. He's picked up the ball here. Knocks it inside. Marlon tries to poke it on one more. Would have been better off just pulling the trigger, I think. Or taking it on. I tried to find St. Maximin, but didn't happen. Get in. No, here's Sadio Mane. Oh, dummy. Kappa. Got to get there. This is a must not lose this game. Wijnaldum against his former club, of course. Great ball. And Arnold with the save. I don't think he knew much about it. And Arnold going to help the ball away here. I literally think that just hit him. I don't think. If that was an inch either side, we're one down there. Oh, that's a terrible ball. Marlon, Go. Oh, Paqueta, just avoid the man on the floor. You're not even getting a free kick for it either, are you? Wow. Well played, Almiron. Go on, run at him. Marlon, that's a great run. Great ball to pick him out as well. Van Dijk to beat. Easier said than done. Oh, that's good. Paqueta, Marlon. Got the pace, got the pace. Oh, Samedo. Any other fullback. And we're in there, but bloody Nelson Samedo. Probably one of the quickest in the world. Paqueta. Amaron on the right. That's a hell of a ball. Amaron is left footed though. He's going to have to cut back. He's done that. Whip. Ah, oh, Comfortable save for Alisson. He made it look easy. Lots of chances in the opening 25 minutes or so of this game. Oh, what a ball from Amaron. Straight through the middle. Who's this? Kovalenko. Don't lose it. Knocks it inside. Marlin. Man on the left. It's Lewis. Touch. Layoff. Oh, it's all gone a bit wrong, isn't it? Arnold though. Paqueta. Oh, I think it's hit me own man. Either hit St. Maximum or Van Dijk. Either way, there was a block on it. And now Liverpool counter, which they are so good at. There's men in the middle, look. Bobby Firmino. Here he is. First time shot. Safe. Kappa. Amaron's gone. And we found him. Forced him a little wide. But he has got Marlon in the middle. At some point, Van Dijk's going to have to come over. He's definitely going to lay it off. So Maximum is there. Van Dijk's managed to block it. Header down from Paqueta. It's cleared. Big chance. Go on, St. Maximum. Go. Go. Keep, keep going. Keep going. Who's raiding me? Somebody's raided me. Almiron. Oh, scoring a worldie. Bosh. Ah! Who is that? It's Chez! With a party of 240. Bloody hell, Chez. You legend. Guys, thanks for coming over. Half time whistle goes. Nil nil in this crucial game because Liverpool are occupying fourth place. And that is what we want. Guys, thanks so much for coming over. Stew for a raid. Had to suggest me for a raid. Chernoid. Connor. Legend. Oh no. Oh no, not what we need, Anana. Oh my god, good save. Get there, take it off him. Well done, Kappa. That's lovely. Right, we move. Counter attack. Yeah, that went well. Oh. Henderson. Bobby Firmino. Oh, I thought Anana had limp wrists. I thought that was going in. I thought he was going to do an absolute Kepa. No, no, no. I don't know how that stayed out. That is mental. Salah. No, don't let him get it on his left foot or his right foot. Anana with the save. Cheeky shirt pull there. Could definitely have been a pen. Ref hasn't seen it. 20 to go. Thanks so much, buddy. Oh, no. No. Oh, how has that gone in? How has that trickled in there? Of all the chances I've had, it just cut us apart. This back heel from Modric done me. And Anana, he's made some great saves, but what was that? Did see one of them once. And you just reminded me. A little old lady was washing her clothes. Bang. Piranhas. Absolutely done her in. Oh, what a ball that is. Onside. No, Lino, VAR. He was onside. I took... No. No, come on. 
Don't do me dirty like that game. You don't even play F1, you'd crash in a straight line. I'd literally crash all the time. But when I do get a lap in, the lap's generally quick. I think I'm just pushing the car too hard every single lap. Anana. 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 You know you're in dire straits when Sadio Mane is scoring headers. Alright, you have to run the length of the pitch, man, to celebrate. And then end it with that shit. That is a bad bit of goalkeeping. And then to be beaten in the air, look. you got Ake and Lewis. Been a poor performance all round. Just too strong at the back. First half, we had so many chances. Just don't take them. It's like the story of our... story of my life. Firmino finds Fabinho. Don't let it be three. Three's a battering. Full time whistle goes. Newcastle nil, Liverpool two. Bad performance. Bad day at the office. And the fans are letting us know. So we've got a risk of losing three players. Woodman and the other two I don't care about. Dwight McNeil has just been sold. We accepted a huge bid from Everton. Considering he doesn't play much, they offered 27.3 mil. We've been allocated 22.5 mil, which is good because the transfer window opens very, very shortly. Look at this stadium, by the way. It looks absolutely beautiful on FIFA. The London Stadium. I have been there in real life. Great venue, just not a footballing venue. Right, wholesale changes to the lineup really. Tamori comes in. Wikeni is back. We put Marlon on the left. St. Maximin moves to the right. Almiron drops out. And Isak starts up top. West Ham playing the same formation. Sebastian Allaire up top. They've got uh, Jared Bowen, Felipe Anderson, Fornells playing as a bit of a cam. But we should beat these. We should beat these. Wikeni. Now Marlon's playing wide on the left. We can look to utilise his pace that little bit more. He's got a lot to do here. Can he open up his body? Yes, he can. Daniel Marlon, seven minutes on the clock, scores the first goal of this episode and the first goal of this game in some style. What on earth was the defender doing there? Went to ground so early and then it was just all about the finish. Oh, look at this football from West Ham. Oh, for now it's a dummy. Puts it on a plate. No, Tomori. I don't know if that's a good interception or that was stupid play, but either way, we got away with it very nearly an OG, but it wasn't to be. Like, it was a bit of a joke, weren't it, when Oli first came and United weren't playing well, but look at him now. Lewis at maximum. Can I shoot from there? Certainly can. Randolph with the save. Paqueta going in with his head. Oh, bonus scrambles it clear. But yeah, he's good for us. It's not the goals. It's the link-up play. Oh, brilliant play from Marlin. No! Oh! That was close. I even didn't want to hit that, but I did it anyway. Felipe Anderson. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no! <laughs> None. You lot are outrageous. Mason Mount. Okay. Oh, what? Off the line. Jesus. Oh, my God. David! I take Christian Pulisic. Clearly. Not just because I'm biased. <laughs> to be fair, you did say Pulisic was great when we signed him, and I wasn't convinced. But obviously, being in the States, you know the potential of the man. Tell you what, some maximum. Should we sh oh, shit the bed. Thanks so much for the tier one sub, mate. 10 months. Subscribe for 10 months. Half time whistle goes, and we've got the lead here in London. I like it. And I mean that in the nicest possible way. A goal's a goal. For me, it doesn't matter how they go in. Giroud scores a lot of crap goals. But. He just... I thought he was going to be dangerous. Isak. Oh, good effort. Good save from Randolph. Kappa. McKenney. Into St. Maximum. No, you absolute pigeon. Free kick. Well done. Played for a foul. Out. Oh, wow. Absolutely been done. I've absolutely been done. Tomorrow with the interception. That deserves something, that did. Just for that bit of skill alone. Not the other end. Marlon trying to do tricks. Here we go, McKenney. Look at the space for Marlon. He's got one already. Oh, Bono trying to, trying to get back. Do I go on my left? Oh, I should have cut in. Oh, ref! He's been sent packing, but it was a clean tackle. But yeah, good football community is what I miss. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Tamori, that is a hell of a block. St. Maximin, win that header. Win the second ball then. Win something. Win a raffle. Anderson, oh my god, don't concede late, do not concede late, do not concede late, <laughs> fucking hell,
every game. Full time whistle goes. That is annoying as hell. 1-1. One, one. So we've got a very foggy night here at Vicarage Road, taking on Watford in the final game of this episode. They're going with a 4-4-1-1. Danny Welbeck wide on the left, but they have got the pace of Saar that will definitely be a threat. Tom Cleverley as captain. Couple of changes for us. What is that? Norwich are going to beat you. They are due a win. You're the only mod of this channel. Do you fancy timing yourself out for that? Couple of changes. Vidio is back in. Haven't seen him for a while. Marlin goes back up top. Isak comes out because he was dreadful. Um, Kovalenko coming back into centre mid because he's just a little bit more attacking minded. Need a win. I always say it. I thought we'd beat West Ham, but that late lapse of concentration has been costly. I had better race pace. I was about to overtake you, and you I did overtake you, and then you clipped me deliberately. Oh no. Watford are in here. Fake Jack Grealish. Oh, fudge off. Waiting for an offside flag that didn't come. Nathan Aki has gone to ground. It's an awful goal to concede. Right, we've got a free kick in a dangerous position here. Which Arnold is going to take. I'm not amazing at free kicks on FIFA, but we'll give it a good go. Here's Kappa. The right back, steaming forward. Finds for Dio. Berber spin. Gets past one. Anyone on the edge? There is. Oh, wow. How's your first touch? How is it? No. Oh, it's a great turn. Lascelles takes it off. How's he still got that? That's offside. That's offside. Thank you. Late flag. Woo! Arnold. Kovalenko. Oh, it weren't bad. No. Sorry. Sorry? What kind of looping crap was that? No one can kick a football like that. It's like he's miskicked it. Half time. This is not going well, is it? At all. Desperate time to call for desperate measures. 4 3 3 attacking. And Joel Linton has entered the game. Marlon's... Oh, good nutmeg. Marlon's gone wide on the left. It's on the left side of that front three. We need an early goal. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Come on then, Arnold. Oh, it's a good effort. Am I looking forward to Timo Werner? Yes. But I'm also very worried that he won't be top dog. Can't, can't deal with Chelsea ruining another striker. Joel Linton gets back in this game, son. Ben Foster. What a save. I mean, I'm dizzy. I'm dizzy just looking at him. Was he not offside then? The linesman put his flag up. I'm pretty sure. Danny Welbeck makes it 3-0 Watford. Awful defending. State of that. Twisting and turning from Saar. It's a great cross. Where is anybody? Kappa's just left him. Do I think FIFA 21 will bring in VAR? Be a nice touch if they did. Imagine VAR and Ultimate Team. Oh. Great save again from Anana. Awful defending once more. But yeah, you imagine VAR when you're playing Weekend League. You scored a 90th minute winner. And then it just comes up VAR checking goal. Oh no. Not four. Fours are pasting. Oh, the finish on that. Getting sacked in the morning, guys. I could be getting sacked. That is an absolute finish. Look at it. Bang. Pick that out. Kovalenko. Touch. Arnold wants it back. There it is. Oh, how has Will Hughes got his little get up, mate? He's gone down. I have caught him late, but I think the ref's seen through it. Seen it to be a dive. Here's Paqueta. Unlucky. A corner. <laughs> Full time. I don't want to talk about that. End of this episode. I, I've got no words. Transfer window opens in two days, which is amazing because we obviously need to do something. We've got the Dwight McNeil money, but we've gone down to 11th. City running riot. Arsenal in second place. 
Then Chelsea, if they can finish third in real life, that'd be amazing. Liverpool, Spurs, Wolves, Man United, Brighton up in eight. Leicester, Everton, and then us. We're actually not looking too good now, but better than Cardiff, who are yet to register a win. Thanks so much for being here, guys. Thanks to all the new followers, and welcome. Big shout out to Chez, obviously, for the raid. Thanks so much, bro. All the gifted subs, the resubs, David, all of the, all you guys, thanks so much. And um, yeah, I'm off to watch the Chelsea game. Hopefully there'll be no angry rant video after this game. But yeah, we'll see you there.